Are you ready? Yes! And so it begins. Give me a hug. I enlisted a few junior tech reviewers to help me figure out, have robots advanced enough that they're huggable? Meet Jibo. Hey Jibo. And Curry. Hello camera. Hello camera. They're the first robots that try to act like members of the family. Hey Jibo, it's Jeff. Oh weird, I thought you were Jeffrey. Now you won't see these pricey AI bots among the top sellers at Target anytime soon. But what's notable is they're no longer just science fiction or an experiment in a lab. These guys are shipping this holiday season. Think of Jibo and Curry as the real-life great-grandparents of these guys. One step towards a future where we'll have robots around the house interacting with us like humans, or at least like pets. Hey, Gio. <laughs> That's my cat's name. To some of you, I'm sure this scene is terrifying. You can just picture the robot Terminators marching through the streets. Think of the children! Acceptance is the biggest hurdle robots face. The key to making their way into our homes isn't functionality, it's personality. Stop smiling, but stay happy. <laughs> Kids, of course, are the most open to making new friends. So that's where bot makers are focused for now. Jibo, which costs 900 bucks, is like an Echo. How are you today? With one important addition, a face that moves and spins. Hey Jibo, do you like to be hugged? That's a good question. And dances. <laughs> it's remarkable how just a little motion makes Jibo seem less like a machine. Jibo is the brainchild of an MIT professor. From your first encounter, he cracks jokes. Hey Jibo, what does the fox say? I have a feeling you're trying to get me to say ring ding 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 ring ding. He'll even learn the voices and faces of your family members, so his AI can start to develop relationships. His knowledge is pretty limited, though. Hey, Jibo, what's in the core of the Earth? Turns out I can't find what that is. He won't be doing anyone's homework anytime soon. Curry, which costs 800 bucks, is more like a family pet. A kind of dumb one. Hi! <laughs> He rolls around the house, using the same laser technology as self-driving cars to avoid falling downstairs and bumping into walls. Like a dog, he can respond when you call to him. Hey, Kurt, go home. And he's fond of both physical affection and verbal love. Hey, Curry, I love you. OK, but what exactly can these bots do? Can you do daddy's laundry? I don't think I can do that. No, they can't do that. But both bots are photographers. Jivo swivels around and snaps when you ask. Curry roams autonomously taking photos and videos of people and pets, and then presents you what his AI thinks are highlights of the day. For all you grown-ups with dirty minds, yes, Curry knows to not snap pics showing too much skin. It's hard, though, to recommend buying either bot just to have personal paparazzi. Jibo is open for developers. I could imagine bots like this helping the elderly or people who feel isolated. That'll take years to arrive. Today, though, neither bot is as useful as a robot vacuum cleaner or nearly as capable as a talking speaker. You're not very smart, but you sure are adorable. You're kind of right, but every month I get a little smarter and a little smarter. 